Brizzy Quartet Diddly Squat represent everyone who picks up music later in life. Anne, Chris, Kath and Marilyn have thrown themselves into exhumed since delighting the audience at the Brisbane Live event. It's a fabulous name, Diddly Squat. Where's it come from? Because we knew Diddly Squat. <laughs> Several items have been crossed off the bucket list for the Diddleys. First time busking. I was just shocked. I was pitchy. <laughs> I'd yeah, forgotten well. what I was supposed to do. Guns so we just look like a bunch of dills, really. Yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> First time in a recording studio, learning every step of the way. To put a click track there and try and hold you to a tempo is going to be difficult. Yes, I know that, Joe. Trying not to stress out too much and ask the universe for help. Because <laughs> God knows we'll need it. From Diddley HQ to Rudy Hill, here's Diddley Squat. Here they are, ladies and gentlemen, performing when the war is over. Welcome, Diddley Squat. Now, now, because, because we can, because we can. Gorgeous. Deadly Squats. 
Beautiful girls. That was great. That was great. Well done. We done good. You done good. <laughs> we done, done good. good. Well done. Now, you all okay? Yeah, I'm shaking a little. Still but shaking yeah, a little, little bit, bit there. But I'll be better after <laughs> something to do. But I think of, of all the bands, you know, you think, you think you're, you're Glitter Gang. Oh, they've been hacking it out oh, for years, fabulous. really. They're fabulous. They're fabulous. Oh, they're fabulous. Mm, but fabulous. for you guys, what a huge step. This has been enormous. It has been a big step, James. <laughs> <laughs> very, very big step. Very big, but we, we've loved it and uh, it's such a great concept yeah. and we're really happy to be yeah. here. Well, yeah. I think you've really got something very beautiful. It's a beautiful, beautiful sound. Thank you. Julia, do you love it? And Chris, Kath and Marilyn. Um, I may have teared up in the beginning of that song <laughs> because for me you represent the true healing power of music and friendship and what it is to come together with people and play. Thank you. And this notion too that, you know, uh, you know, men and women start to become invisible when they hit 50 for some reason and that pisses me off. <laughs> And uh, what I love is that you're doing things that you never thought you would probably do, taking up an instrument, practising, getting together, and, well, look where you've ended up here in the final of Exhumed. That brought me such joy. It brought the audience such joy. Would you please keep keeping on and keeping yeah. on playing because yeah. you're amazing. Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Not a dry eye in the house, Tim. Little catch in the throat. A little catch in the throat, Tim, eh? I was catching the throat. Uh, yeah. in, I remember in episode four, there was a lot of talk in the recording studio about consistency and um, consist rhythms. You're getting and the beat right. Rock and roll and jazz are essentially euphemisms for making love. And if making love is consistent, I don't want to be a part of it. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you 3,000 shows, I reckon about 13 albums, and 300 years of love. <laughs> God bless you. <laughs> Fantastic. Just quickly, Claire, you loved it? Uh, look, I think Julia, Julia and Tim really said it all, but the number of times in my life that I've had people come up to me, strangers, uh, some of the people in the audience and say, I wish I was a musician, I wish I could play music. And from now on, I'm going to say to them, excuse me, have you not heard of Diddly Squat? <laughs> <laughs> Let's get on with it. Well done, guys. Thank you. Thank you, Thank judges. You. Girls, after a fairly nerve-wracking few months, you can now finally relax. Go and get yourself something refreshing. Have a good lie down. How much do we love Diddly Squat?